give thanks, give thanks, give thanks and praise for mystic laws of the universe and its protective functions and forces in nature that guide our thoughts and our part in our ways that are lawful for them to prosper. We do give thanks and praise the infant estate. That man, that is the John Henry Doe, the all capital name estate. That's the infant estate that was created when you're an infant or a child, as they would say. Yeah, well, so they are them about some children. Huh? Mm -hmm. The gift don't see the time when my bombs man children. Yeah. So with the panda energy right now, more time or some more spiritual drums means a man like to eat. Yeah, them thing be more serenade right now. However, we are touched upon the infant estate. Latin, the word infant would mean unable to speak. From in. In Latin, in mean not. So when they say in specter, it mean not specter. They say in in front of most words, it have dual meaning people. However, because they must say English, they just use the English definition, but for the people who truly apply themselves, they must always use the etymological definition along with the legal definitions, not just the ordinary. So it's a Latin definition for infant mean unable to speak. From in, not, and fant, speaking, so not speaking. So infant mean not speaking. And this is just the basic breakdown. Because we have touched this from all different aspects, from all different point of view conceptually so we are kind of approach it i remember you know self-taught and we have sesta q trust our people can ref you know do their own, their own research we touch on these things years ago we talk about the sesta wkv trust and all of these things coming out of britain yeah man from the Britain, the British Empire, one of the times them burned down London City and them say all records disappeared. You know, these foreign peoples are strategists. Call them foreign master with what them call Satan, Lucifer, the deceiver, the accuser. Yeah, you have, you have to call them ones that genius. Yeah, cause even the very saints, them are corrupt and pollute. And even more so, we were righteous. You know what I mean? Them are going to definitely try at us. But for them, intelligence is outside of this world, outside of this earth. So the people them we are chose to play a game on that level can. We just keep it simple and take it step by step. Because if we do not know, we are a fool to what we don't know. So it make no sense here. Apply processes where you learn from some Freemasonic agencies or organizations when you not have the full disclosure or you're not even close. You just a look and escape and put in yourself, you know, more enslaved. Put it that way. So we are success to a KV trust our birth. A nomenclature, our birth account, and our birth bond. This is our birth right. This is our thing. Where some foreign people come, you serve naturally and make it look like we not have nothing at all. However, this is where they are used to operate them system that is in place. It said it says, Q it trusts. Is a legal term for an individual who is the beneficiary of a trust or an insurance policy. So the trust is also an insurance policy. That's why we talk about that bond. This is why we talk about the bond. God them use it as currency. 
That's why we call it a sophisticated financial instrument. I'm talking about that very Linton O'Neill Dallas in all caps associated with the birth registration form here on this island. Yeah, man. So it's a, uh, the trust is a legal term for an individual who is the beneficiary of a trust or an, or an insurance policy with rights to property and the income and profits that the property provides. This is why it's a sophisticated financial instrument. Sestui KV Trust is the person entitled to an equitable rather than legal trust in the estate assets. So, trustees them can deal with the legality while we just deal with the equity. We are fair, <coughs> at least bring them information forward in as many ways as we can. Only for bring our people, you know, to this level. It's not about what we see out there in the public, per se, in the public arena. Whatever you see are going on in the public, you have an equal activity going on in the private. It's just that because you're infants, you haven't attained the age of majority, then this information now going to be privy to the infants. <clears throat> and again, I was say the infant is unable to speak. This is why when we go in a court and I verbalize them, can say all kind of things to them have we classified as infant. Yeah, remember, you, know, you do not have your birth nomenclature. Your birth name is not on that document. You understand? You have what is known as the hypothecated form, the all capital form, which is a registered organization only because it's created as such. I hope my people are following step by step. In. Step by step. Again, when we touch on the trust being an insurance policy, we can look at the notice of recognizance document that I get from the Greater Portmore Police Station. It wasn't issued to me by a resident magistrate, and it wasn't at a court of record. So that alone, in and of itself, made the document unenforceable. However, we are demonstrate the fraud because on that document, you see where it have a prisoner, where I had to endorse, and you have a surety where I had to endorse under coercion and threat, violence, because these people are armed and dangerous. But not all of them bad enough to come and tell you about the good people that is there. So you have good agents and you have bad agents. Some of the agents, them not necessarily bad, them just uninformed or uneducated. So I now go really say, because them uneducated, them bad, it's not necessarily synonymous. You know what I mean? However, you have those kind of instances where they're uneducated and they're bad out there as agents. Yeah, man. So it has said, the Sestui KV Trust is an account we inherited due to the bankruptcy of all corporate agencies in 1933 and the subsequent ceasing of all gold, silver, and other assets as collateral for the public debt, changing or replacing the substance-backed system with a substance-void system where substance is replaced with a promise, a 
hope my people are get it, you know. Again, in you know, self thought, and we have to arrange it according to us. They are then can take it and do the same. Negotiable instruments are the new currency, backed by the full faith and credit of the infant's pledge, using the birth registration system to pledge the infant or child or the people as the new financial collateral for the corporate agency's public debt. Next level with that one. I remember everyone with a boy have a birth certificate. All when you never get none, then we sub ascribe one to you. This is how it go, God. This is how them flees. You, this is how them trespass without your consent and knowledge and rape you, sodomize you, victim, listen, brutally, unapologetically, only because you're unaware. Of this act by this agency and its agents. Now forget the knowledge. This says to we gave the trust account, this birth account, our birth account, contained millions of dollars in your name. The only problem is that the government and legal system fail to inform you about it and how to access your money. In the meantime, they are drawing down on it for their own personal use and as payment to the Vatican and English crown, as payment to foreigners. For all of the business, them are the foreigners, them are benefit from it. It is the funds, the very birth bond funds contained in the trust, the Sesta Q trust that the administrative examiners called judges, court clerks, and county prosecutor are really after or interested in. I have proven that because in my notice of recognizance, I had to put up a $100,000 bond when we improved to a million dollars. And you people know me never give them no cash, nowhere. Nowhere. So where is that cash? Just appear from for me to get my own recognizance. That's because that surety belongs to me. In it. And the surety is that name title. Is it not? And you can only interface with that birth certificate piece of paper. That's the entity. The very birth certificate, the birth registration form. That's the only entity you people can interface with only because you are in that corporate capacity, that artificial capacity, that legal name title capacity. And remember, legal is not lawful. Two different words, two different meanings. With legality, they develop, the agency develop legal standards. Alternatively, used as rules or regulations. Those are not law. Those are legal standards for the agency and its employees. These are the subtlety of the people. Yeah, man. So it says, this trust actually pays all your debts. Remember, you know, $100,000 surety. So that trust, the Linton O'Neill Dallas, all capital name, that trust, that's what put up the, that's the debtor. The surety is the debtor. Yeah, man, sophisticated financial instrument. So them just go in at that account and take out a hundred thousand dollars. Book data entry. It's all just computer mess around in the you know behind the scenes. You people not gonna know these things unless a man like me I talk these things. Only show me I experience these things. God, these people is outside the law in their actions. 
the supreme law of the land, which is a constitution. Do not give these guys no permission to abrogate, abridge, or infringe upon your inherent dignity as man. So they can violate you as man in order to fleece your juristic person or your surety or your legal entity. They have no right. It's only through silent deception and inducement by fraud does these people operate until you can, just as I, presenting the fraud. Demonstrating the fraud. Yeah, man. So it's not just talk. So, not just talk, people. Yeah, man. Them so the trust actually pays all your debts, but nobody tell you because the elite, these people, will prop themselves up like these public authority officers. These so-called elite consider those assets to be their property and the Federal Reserve System, which is a foreign system, is responsible for management of those investments. So again, when you talk about the infant estate or the Sester Q Trust, remember, what is the creation of a trust? The exchange or the transfer of property. So the moment your mom presents a birth registration application to certify your child as a grantor, she has present that document to an agency and the agency as recipient becomes a public trustee. And we, the offspring, become the beneficiaries naturally. This is why this trust was in place because them not have no more substance as gold and silver as money. They removed that. However, them give you a piece of document where say you use this as an insurance policy against anything and everything. This is what's going on, people. But the truth Sounds so much like fiction. It makes you have to wonder. Truly. Is when you really experience it. You can express it. So a lot of the ones. Them when I really walk the walk. And just like to talk. And then tell us that you're angry. Especially a lot of the foreign people. Who quick to tell us that you're angry. And you're angry at the government. And you're at, no you're not. You just have to talk the truth. Because you're foreign to this location and you bring this foreign construct here. Well, Uno mastered this foreign construct a long time ago. So Uno can have wind circles telling us to look here and look there and study this and study that. And it take you another 50 years before you can get close to what is going on. We don't have the interest. Take your foreign information to your foreign people. You know what I mean? We can deduce. Whatever it is for ourselves, man, and take our time. We're not angry. Why are we angry when we are taught the truth? When you foreigners came here, invaded this location, and slaughtered our people, were you not angry? Were you not jealous as foreigners, as foreign invaders? So now that you, the offspring of these criminals, these vagabonds, you're going to tell us to not be angry when we are not angry with us and manifest the truth. What's your point of origin? Look at China right now. I'm going to see a flood of Chinese people coming to America again. All over that side of the world is chaotic. Only because them of them man-made weather, where they manipulate the weather. That's the war where them have over there. So when you catch a news clip here, you see all kind of 
craziness going on over their side. The very same way they'll come over here and pollute our side. Now I give away a continent or a hemisphere to just no island. All right, our one. So people slowly but surely I get the information. And when them start remove the colonial narrative like these maroon narrative who are the very Moors who are the very Islamic when we start remove those narrative then the truth are going to manifest itself naturally that's when you won't have a problem saying Arawak or Awak you won't have a problem saying Sibane you won't have a problem saying parati people. You won't have a problem saying yen kun kun pikibo people. This is us. All of our variety. And when you hear me, them not look like no foreigners. No, no, even a mixer. Them look like I. Yeah. And when them light skin, them still have look like I. Still have our real not this different phenotype you understand not this long stringy ear thing this is why we born the corporate concept and construct known as just jamaica you don't notice the government agency never tell you about how them love the people of Jamaica. Them just love the land of Jamaica because that's where them are exploited. And then them convert the people into commodity where them have the bird certificate. It is in the very same location where they house land and other properties. So you, the people, become the human resource. And then legalize all of this. So your slavery is legalized. And you accept it voluntarily, willfully. But it's unknown to you. Because there are so much different distractions. And all kind of entertainers now want to become political leaders. Want to become cultural leaders. And these very entertainers are now teaching the very subjects out there. However, like most other things, truth remains the truth and truth will naturally reveal itself. However, slowly. Yeah, man. Now, most people realize, hey, we are no Africans. Now, most people realize, how can you worship a man such as the creation and ignore the creator? You understand? People are kind of figure it out now. People kind of start comprehend all of these religions. People are all true to them spiritual aspect. The spiritual concept. People have figured it out now. The righteous warrior them out there take them time to balance themselves. That is not badness. Some man have to refrain and remove themselves from them kind of badness there. Just like the criminality. You think they don't go profit or enemy or adversary because they are always been the accuser they've always been accusing us yeah man the most i chosen people whether you like it or not we are such divine people in our earth but them spoil we are so we have to find back what balance and that is a step-by-step -step process yeah, man. So 
let us say the social security or the treasury registration number, Medicare, Medicaid, are all financed by the very birth trust. The government makes you pay taxes and a portion of your wages supposedly to pay for these services, which they can borrow at any time for any reason since they cannot access the Sestuvi KV Trust to finance their wars or to bail out Wall Street and their patron corporations. You may receive a monthly statement from a mortgage company, loan company, or utility company, which usually has already been paid by the trust. Which trust? The bird trust. Oh, you know you have a bird trust. So the bird trust is your bond, a bird bond, bond paper. That bird registration form is a bond paper. But the devil stepped through and flipped the script. Big devil switch. You understand? And I tell you, you are no longer the beneficiary, your owner. So you are liable for all debts. All what debts? We have to rebut these things and correct these things and put these parasitic sodomites in their places. But they are just that. A parasitic sodomite. Yeah. That's what they are. Yeah, man. Parasitic, sadomatic type of people. Oh, them not know they're filthy. Them not know they're working for the adversary. They are clueless. Oh, they are trained, conditioned, and institutionalized to operate accordingly. And their only statement will be. We're just doing our job, that's one, or we're just following the law. But what law are you following? I mean, which law? And can you demonstrate or present that law with your delegation of authority to enforce any kind of Regulatory enforcement. Them way I will have to start, you know. Check these people. It's almost all these corporate business double dip, meaning them want you pay when everything is already paid. So them double dip. That's what the court I deal with. This is why so the judge them can act as sophisticated like them wealthy. Like them know some things where nobody else know. And them laugh at you and call you a ward of them state. Or them call you a lunatic of unsound mind. Or them just basically call you an infant. Which means you cannot speak. I man have no problem rebutting these things. Because these parasitic sodomites will not stop. So you have to bring them out in the light. Expose their fraud. Expose their nakedness. And classify them as just what they are. A group of parasitic sodomites. Where them originate? Foreign of them, man. But them employ other people. So the people where them employ become like them. Naturally. Just like how oh, I rebut the fact say I am your slave, you better rebut the fact that you're not a parasitic sodomite. And you can rebut that fact by doing what is lawful, what is correct, doing what is right. You parasitic sodomite. No pet for you people. No powder puff, no pampering. You're demons in disguise. Yeah, man. Demon in disguise, man. With the have a judgment on you know, in a disguise. Lawfully. Mm. And burn your legality. Your legality not apply to the lawful man. 
would choose to conduct himself accordingly. Go burn it, man. So all these corporate businesses doubled it and hope that you have been conditioned well enough by their credit scam to pay them a second time. Instead of paying the statement next time, sign it, approve, and mail it back to them. If they then contact you about payment, ask them to send you a true bill instead of a statement, and you will be glad to pay it. A statement document what was due and paid, whereas a true bill represents only what is due. Banks and utility companies have direct access to the SES2KV trust account, and all they need is your name, your TRN number, and your endorsement, whether your fingerprint, your autograph, or a signature. And just need a mark to endorse it saying, yes, you consent. So this is basically what I go on out there, people. This are for basic people. So we're going to keep reiterating and keep going back over some of these things, you know. So people can have access to the information and do their own basic research. Yeah, man. Do their own basic research. I touched upon this information already, but I can run over it real quick. It's a chat. Yeah. And them thing how to cancel your social security corporation we now endorse that with us i said if, if you need to you know how to cancel your birth bond you know what i mean when them get too you know hostile you can tell them say f off yeah and federal children are you people out there all of you are federal children all of you have a driver's license with the all caps name where you endorse by signing it agreeing that the all caps name is you all of you people are federal children. All of you have a birth certificate and totally not have this information. I will try to make my effort to say, hey, <coughs> there's a separation of entities here. They are called federal citizens. Now, a man like me, them have them drug nets, so them just grab me in them net. So, because them do that, them expect me to play the L.A. Lewis role and pay them some money and you know, business as usual. No. May I challenge them authority for them arrest for them not have none, which is them control and jurisdiction. Them not have none. And may I demonstrate so them are perpetrate fraud without my, you know, voluntary consent, informed consent. Them are perpetuate fraud. We are demonstrate that notice of recognizance with two entity, two separate and distinct entity. A surety and a prisoner. Easily demonstrate fraud. When we are protesting with a consent and we have a so-called judge who is biased, totally partial to our agency because this is how she gets paid. So she doesn't have no interest in being a fact finder or a you know, umpire or being you know, fair and impartial. So this, you know, qualifies a disqualification on these, you know, unqualified administrative examiners or adjudicative, you know, whatever you want to call them officers, call them of a, you know, function a certain way, where them can, you know, assume that title. But when I'm outside the law and I misconduct in office, then you're not more than some parasitic sodomites, vagabonds with certificates. So we call them certificated vagabonds. And they live like parasites of the unknown people. You think that dollars and cents you have in your hand that's going on here. No. It's the sophisticated financial instrument, that currency where you cannot see. It's just book data entry. And they have a double book data entry operation going on. Where they probably 
engaged. It should be the accrual method of accounting, but these people have what is known as a creative method of accounting. Them create it as them go along. Because it's their, you know, legal standards they are developing. Not law. Them have the whole world show. Them have the whole world trip. Well, not all, but most. However, you know, again, show to for manifest itself. This document said in 1921, the Federal Shepherd Tower Maternity Act created the birth registration or what we now know as the birth certificate. It was known as the Maternity Act, which exists today, creating federal children. So when you have a birth certificate, you become a federal child until you fix it. You understand? Until you attain the age of majority, so you can discuss it and put it in writing. And when them come and say, hey, here is a notification, your ignorance now, you know, excuse you. So this is where our people, you know, need for kind of elevate themselves to the level. This government, under the doctrine of parents portray, now legalize. Now, them say, now legislate. I remember, you know, we have House of Parliament. You understand? So them do the legislating where them say them are right and change law. We don't know right and change law. We don't right and change legal standards. You understand? You only in a statutory instrument, a statutory capacity. And everything requires consent. And when we not consent, we not trespass. Simple. So it said, I'm legislate for the Jamaican or the Jamaican children as if they are owned by the federal government. That's why them bully we on top of we are water in the state. All when we are tell them, say, Uno are the water for Uno own state. And Uno choose to be that. Don't bring it on us when we are. So we are not. Through the public school enrollment process and containing and continuing license requirements for most aspects of daily life, these federal children grow up to be adults indoctrinated into the process of asking for, asking for permission from the government to do all those things necessary to carry out daily activities that exist in what is called a free country. So if you if you live in a free country, why the mess you need for your ask any kind of man or woman permission to do anything at all when you're not breaking any laws, when you're not committing no crime? This is how it is, you know, this is what it is saying, you know, but to our people, especially with university, brighties, the scholarly ones, um, where Go on like said them all of that. And totally lack this level of information. Some of you know, need for us come on board and apply some of you know, you know, brilliant technique to this kind of show. That's what's needed. And you know, fluff on yourself like you know, all of that when you know. some of you know, dance, you know, you know, just blind like rap bat. Yeah, can't answer the truth all when it's right there in front of you. But a lot of you are agents, a lot of you have an ulterior motive, a lot of you have no personal problems where without money, you cannot exist. When you're not hungry, you have to think about money. You can't think about food. Understand, some money become on a god. Money become on the world. Yeah, man. Juno Monita, that goddess, is where on idolize silently, subliminally, unknowingly. And then it corrupt on you. And when Juno Monita withdraw herself from on like an addict, someone go crazy. Literally. 
Right? It makes sense to get this side of the information. You know what I mean? And do the research and see if there is truth there. And if there is, then level the fallacy. Stand up in a truth. Yeah, man. So it has a... Uh, the state claim an interest in every child within its jurisdiction. I'm always telling her about people claiming an interest down to the very bank. When I have a non-interest bearing account, the bank can ever talk to me. Simple. That's it. Non-interest bearing. What is your interest? When there is none, then stand down. You understand? Or if you choose to, you know, donate to some charity where we can create, then that's fine. But because we now have truth, because, you know, the distraction is so huge, then the devil loses. Yeah, man. They will find a home with most of you people out there. It's not easy, you know, but it's not hard to spot. All you have to ask yourself if you live righteous enough and just look at how you live. That's all, you know. Just look at how you live. Just look at you. Just look in the mirror. Look in the mirror. Yeah, man. And you do a self-evaluation, self-introspection, and be truthful. And wherever you find the false, them, you just choose for correct it. You don't need no outside intervention. This is why we know, sir, he that is righteous, I must say, righteous still. And he that is filthy, I must say, filthy still. I don't know what the truth is. I'm going to reject it. I want to know what good is and reject it. I want to know what righteousness is and reject it. The state via Child Protective Service will, if it deems necessary, nullify your parental rights and appoint a guardian, which is a public trustee over your children. We are the beneficiaries of that public trust. The subject of every birth certificate is the child. The child is an asset which, if properly trained, can contribute valuable assets, plural, provided by its labor for many years. Let's see how the construct View you infants out there. Uh, enough I want to hear the word infant and right away you know, on a set up. Them not talk to me because me and a baby are picnic. But look up that word legally. You might be surprised. It says a child is an asset. Yeah, touch that. It's a, it is presumed by those who have researched this issue that the child itself is the asset of the public trust established by the birth certificate and the social security or tax registration number is the numbering or registration of the trust allowing for the assets of the trust to be tracked or traced or identified. If this information is true, your child is now owned by the state via the birth registration form. We can rebut them things that easily. Each one of us, including our children, are considered assets of the bankrupt government. We are now designated by the government as human resources with a new crop being born every year. Well, I touch upon these things so it can bring some awareness and shock some people and then other people will ignore the thing because uh, that is natural. However, information share out there. Again, 
it's a load to the organic subscribers for your organic subscription naturally. Just as how we get it, as how we just share it. We're not paying our money for our information. And that's the time where we spend and make sure we qualify the information only for bring closure. Yeah, man. So we don't have a problem of qualifying the information and present it freely. So again, complete gratitude out there.